Meanwhile, Hobart City has pulled off the recruiting coup of the off-season with Payne joining the club for 2016. But Cricket Tasmania doesn't need to panic. The keeper batsman won't be pulling on the boots for the Demons. Instead, he'll be working behind the scenes in an off-field role. Payne isn't the first player to cross codes, but most before him have done it as players. He'll spend one day a week with the Demons developing skills away from cricket. I'm certainly here to help, uh, there's no doubt about that, but um, it's certainly about, I suppose, building our, our partnerships um, with, with businesses in our community and in the Hobart City community, so um, that's mainly what's based around at the moment. While Payne has many years of cricket left ahead of him, the former Test player says it's important to put retirement plans into place right now. I wish I'd have done a little bit more um, earlier, um, but I suppose coming into a, a professional system when I was 15, 16, um, you know, it, it was probably a little bit hard, but uh, I've matured a lot now and uh, realised the importance of, of having something outside of cricket. Payne joining the club is a win-win for both parties, with the Demons keen to continue establishing a strong presence in the local community. We're trying to attract quality people and, and uh, develop quality people, so uh, that, that creates a really good culture at a club and, and uh, Tim's going to just value add um, to what we're about and, and our future direction. The Payne name is synonymous at fellow TSL club Clarence, but the 31-year-old is hopeful his old club won't hold a grudge. I'm sure they'll be OK. Um, a lot of the guys, well, I haven't been at Clarence for, for a few years apart from doing a little bit of running, so I don't think my, my brother was too happy about it, but um, uh, look, that's footy and, and this is business, I guess. But try telling that to the coach. I've actually said to him he can come along to training and we might be able to slot him in at, full, uh, at uh, forward pocket. So it might be an interesting thing. That he, yeah, he hasn't pulled the boots on for a while, he said that. The Demons' first match of the season is against the Tigers on Good Friday.